the variations here are an RDL or a straight leg deadlift. If you're really flexible, you can get the straight leg deadlift. If you're not, you'll be doing an RDL. Main thing you want to focus on is not losing posture, not flexing the spine at all through this motion. So the first part, you'll be able to tell real quick if you can get it. You can look in the mirror and just be able to get this position. That shows that you can get it. All right, now under load, that might change and you might lose it. So you're gonna kind of find your range of motion that you can get to. So the first thing you need to do is get the weight up. You can bend the knees and do a traditional deadlift to get up. So the weight's gonna be at an angle like this. First thing we're gonna do, hip width stance. We're sitting tall, everything's locked in. And we're gonna start sliding that weight down the thighs, shooting the butt back, okay? Shins are staying vertical, we're trying to maintain that posture. I'm gonna make it to about here, and that's where I'm gonna start losing my posture. You're gonna pause for three, and then we're gonna come back up, keeping that weight close to the body. <sighs> Slow movements here. Unhinge, come down, maintaining posture. Neck is neutral, not extended, and then back up. That's gonna be uh, the movement. We're only gonna try to get to five. Five should be your all out max. So that's how you're gonna decide your weight. If you start losing posture, bring down the load. If you can't make it to five reps, bring down the load. If you can't maintain your tempo, bring down the load. Um, now on the other hand, if you're blasting through it and it's not totally annihilating you, exhausting everything, lactic acid, uh, you're breathing heavy, heart's pumping, um, it's not enough weight. This should be really, really tough to get through uh, five